uh, couple of injuries. Obviously, Simmons' back is a bit of a worry. Pocock has unfortunately um, displaced. He's got a displaced fracture in his eye socket, so he'll be out. I think up to six weeks, four to six weeks, something like that. Uh, once he's recovered, and uh, there's a few uh, a few niggles and and bumps and bruises, but nothing more than you normally expect from a test match encounter. Obviously, a huge blow to lose Oh yeah, I think um, he played very well last night. You know. How would you? Um, sorry, how would you look to replace him? Ah, uh, look, we'll just see how we pan out. We we wait for the final. We got the final confirmation this morning, so we'll just wait and see how the day pans out around what we think we might take into next week's game. We'll have a look at some options that we have. You know, we have the option of staying with what we've got, or if we want to bring in almost the life for life, go for Liam Gill. Just see how that how that pans out during the day. Could be Palu probably would come right into the reckoning. There's opportunities. Ben McCalman as well. You know, yeah. Sean McMahon. So there's 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 options there that have got experience in the front line. So um, so we're fortunate there. But at the same time, disappointed to lose a player of David's quality. Yeah, what Does that with him out? Yeah. Oh, well, obviously the skills he brings to the game, no doubt, and that the, that dynamic that we have in the back row with himself, Michael, and, and Scott. But we'll, we'll, um, we'll probably create a different type of complementary nature now, or we could go like for like. Depends on what um, what we think might be. But once we look at the game again today as coaches, we'll have a look and see what we want to go with um, and how we might want to play the game next Saturday. And if we think we should keep that. We'll go like for like. If we think we should change a little, we might do something different. Well, 